New at 6 tonight, the promise of a smoother ride out on the freeway. Two bumps are catching drivers by surprise out in the zoo interchange. Fox 6's Brett Lemoyne with the plan to get them fixed. From high above, it's hard to see just how big they are. But as you watch from the ground, you can see two bumps in the zoo interchange that really have a bounce to them. The ramp from eastbound I-94 to southbound I-894 is anything but smooth. We've received some calls over time. Um, you know, that's why we did put up the advisory signage, letting people know that those were the bumps that were ahead. Michael Pirates with the Wisconsin DOT says weather caused these particular speed bumps. Moisture gets trapped underneath the roadway, and then during the winter months it freezes, which actually elevates the roadway. Pirates says the DOT has gone out several times to grind down the heaves and level them out. Sky Fox doesn't do them justice. So really the only way for you to get an idea of what it's like is to join us in the driver's seat. We took a few passes on the ramp just to give you multiple perspectives. We're going 45 miles an hour right now and here comes bump number one. Hold on. Both bumps are well marked and we were going the posted speed limit. Now approaching bump number two. Buckle up. Still you can see the tires and this driver physically react. Pirate says it's been about two years since construction of the zoo interchange wrapped up with another phase set to start soon. He says it won't be long now until this stretch gets flattened out. We were waiting for the north leg of the zoo interchange to get going. We're going to be using that contractor to actually bring down crews and equipment to do the repairs. In Milwaukee County, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News.